In the first video, I'm going to talk about structural integration and how it works well for back pain. So this is, this is one of the primary reasons why people come into my office is for back pain. And for most people, they're experiencing lower back pain, somewhere in this lumbar region, sacroiliac pain down in here, possibly with radiating sciatica, uh, sometimes with numbness into the legs and such. Uh, people will get mid-back tightness and pain and upper back tightness and pain. So the thing about uh, lower back pain to start with is that lower back pain can be the result of a couple of different situations. One, either the, the lower back area is extremely tight and compressed, which happens often if a person has a very strong stomach muscle or they have a belly. Uh, the second thing that can happen, or if they're in spasm down here, sometimes it will spasm up and it'll be completely tight. Uh, the other low back pain situation I often see is where the upper and middle back are extremely tight and the lower back is completely loose. It's the exact opposite, where there's no stability. So either way, you create a situation where the lower back curve flattens out and you get uh, uh, weight bearing on, the, sp on the, uh, uh, the vertebrae and on the intervertebral discs which will sometimes push them into the spinal nerves that come out of the spine here and serve different various areas of the, of the body. For some people, it's more of a muscular issue. For some people, it's degenerated into a more of a nerve and soft tissue uh, degeneration issue. So depending on how far along you are, the less far along you are, the more quickly you will experience relief. That's for low back. If you're far along in the process, you will still experience relief, but it will take longer. I don't know of anything that works better for long-term uh, disc problems or uh, the like. Now, short-term, different story, and that's something you can consult with me privately on. But long-term, absolutely. Short-term lower back pain and tightness, rolfing is great for that. We loosen up the area in the lower back. For the for the lower back situation where it's too loose, I mean where it's too loose and the upper and middle back is tight, that's great because we loosen up the middle and upper back. All this in the first session, the very first session. So the first session is a fabulous session for lower back pain, any kind of back pain in general because we work all along the back and all along the front of the torso and the connectors to the, uh, the main connectors to the pelvic girdle and to the shoulder girdle. So for the first, any kind of back pain, the first session of structural integration is a fabulous start. I encourage you to try it. Uh, know that I never ask people to come in and do an entire series. People will call me and be interested in that and I'll just tell them no. Try a session, see if it's gonna work for you, and then make the decision. When you feel the change in your body, a change in your body that you've never felt before, something that has changed your body in a way that you've never experienced before, that's powerful, and that will, you'll either feel that or you won't. And if you do, why then it'll make sense probably to do more. If you don't, why then it probably won't make sense for you to do more. Either one's fine. Uh, tomorrow I'll send you another video uh, farther along in the series. It's not going to be on back pain. It'll be on a different topic. See you then.